fantastic. Those are definitely huskies. So definitely huskies. <laughs> oh man. What do you know about uh, helpers? Okay. So Helper has a super, super nice way of playing Diddy that I really enjoy watching. I wish I had a specific way to describe it. I guess he kind of just beats your face. It's like, you don't... When Helper plays, as soon as he takes the lead from you, you can't breathe. And it's like, you really need that time to think. And when you don't have that time to think, you, you lose immediately. And it becomes... No, not really. Because wow. I've seen a lot of Diddy mains that have dropped Diddy after they've been nerfed. Nope. Helper has been playing him for a long time now. And we have game one. Hopefully... Oh, I gotta change that. Sorry about that, guys. Alright, we've got a... Spin Ooh, very nice combo from Gonski. Hey, it's doing very good. Uh, Pit is pretty decent in this matchup because he gets in super fast and uh diddy uh it's a little bit hard for diddy to time his bananas from what i've seen very nice move there just jumping out yep like i said he just likes to beat your face in exactly wow very nice not giving any time to breathe right now pick can't do anything even off the map he can't really do much it's gonna work his way back onto the stage now. Back on very nice forward smash there. But he has the banana in hand. Gets up smashed. Not death. Good DI from Bounce Giddy. Ooh, that was a really nice ledge drop uh, down there. Popping helper up. Forward throw will not take it. Yeah, no. It's already 151. Ooh, nice snuff. Oh, but Helper says, let me kick you right in your mouth for that. How dare you. Respect your elders. Ooh! The most upsetting thing is I'm nearly 100% sure that would have broke shield had it not killed. So there's really no actual escape to that. 22% off of barrels. Helper's taking extra credit and styling while he's in it. He's taking that young extra credit dance course. Here, you gotta style. You gotta look good. Look good for the ladies. That total mask will help. Yep. And it's, looking, it's looking hard. This is looking like a harder matchup than I originally thought it was. But Bounce is playing it pretty well. Helper just kind of isn't giving him too much time to think. Very nice uh, gauntlet there. Pit, unfortunately, does not have the jump speed like a lot of people to be able to punish Diddy Kong uh, monkey flipping from high. Well, he's too floaty. Yeah, he's way too floaty. So... Punishing Monkey Foot from high is going to be incredibly hard. He has to find a really nice way to read it. So it's a super good recovery option for Jeff currently. Uh, it's going to be back throw. Putting him off the map. Not killing yet, but uh, he has the banana in hand, which means trip is death currently. Yep. Oh, back throw. Nice. Yeah, we're not dead yet. That's not death. Very nice. Very nice from Pounce Kitty. going to take that one stop. Oh, nice. Down tilt up smash. Wait, you can't see. Helper takes game one. Yeah. That was a fun game one. That was a really good looking was, game it one. It was nice, fast pace. Bounce definitely yeah. proving me wrong. He's playing pretty nice. Yeah, he's doing pretty well. So why is this matchup favorable for Pit? Since you said earlier. Oh, I don't think it's favorable for Pit. I just don't think it's as bad as Diddy Kong versus other people can be. Um. I think Pit loses that matchup mostly because although he has the speed to get in, eh, he, he ends up struggling to kill versus Diddy. Because what happens is if Pit keeps you out with his disjointed hitboxes, you can't get in there. Jeff is running Falco. Y'all see me y'all saw me body as Falco a while back, Kappa. Uh no, it's Falco's good. Uh, I like the way he goes about playing. He plays it a lot like Diddy Kong in the sense that he doesn't let you think. He has a toad. He has a toad mask, but he's not using peach, so I don't know. Why would he I know, mask? he's a fraud. Yeah. I'm kidding. Yo. Oh, he throws out a preemptive uh, reflector, thinking that Bounce Kitty is going to go for an arrow that never happened. And they're definitely going to be playing a lot of footsies in this matchup, because both of these characters work in the way that it's one grab, one confirm, and then dip, you know? Right. So you take a grab, you take your hit, or series of hits if you can, and then you leave. 
go back again. Bounce can do a nice job right now. Yeah, Bounce is doing a very good job of uh keeping him out with four tilts. Very nice down air. And he's sitting at a 53% lead right now. So Yep. But Falco kills a lot earlier than Pit does. Uh Pit doesn't struggle to kill him because he has a kill throw, but Falco's back air is such a solid move along with his forward air. So if Jeff is able to read a standard get up, he will get a forward smash and be killing Bounce Kitty from about roughly 90. So But as you can see, Pitch Forward Dawn itself is a very good move and it's a very strong move. So currently, uh he'll be killing Helper at around 110. At the ledge. Yep. Both of these hitting a lot of buttons. Both of these players hitting a lot of buttons, but they're not uh, getting as many hits as they're trying to. There's a lot of shield play going on in this matchup, but uh, very nice back air from Bounce Kitty. This might be death. Oh man. Ooh, nice back air. Like I was saying, back air kills pretty sufficiently on Falco. It's a very very good move. Yep. Nice forward air. Forward tilt, death. I feel like stage control is so important in this game right now. Uh, yeah, I would definitely agree. Uh, I mean, it's important in all games, but it's more important in this game because I feel like we've been seeing it like used a lot more in this game right now. Yeah. You're just fumbling on that damage. This is not gonna be easy for bounce. Uh, because Falco's holding the stage pressure right now. So. Nice though, yeah, he's evening it up, and he takes the lead by 4%. Nice forward tilt from Jeff, a nice little get off me option. Very nice base back here. Oh, he just grabs him out of- He says, what is a gauntlet? I'ma punch you in your face. That was great. But Bounce responding in a very nice way, he doesn't care how much you punch him in the face gonna kill you because he's a little angel boy nice forward air from helper spacing it well so that bounce either runs into it or stays in a shield and is unable to punish comes out of shield back air is gonna take it damn very unfortunate but good victory nonetheless from helper helper you're not gonna show